The Book of Hosea, Chapter 2 Say ye unto your brethren only, unto your sisters Ruhama, Breed with your mother, breed, for she is not my wife, neither am I her husband. Let her therefore put away her wildoms out of her sight, and her daughters from between her breasts. Lest I strike her naked, and set her as in the day that she was born, and make her as a wilderness, and set her like a dry land, and slay her with thirst. And I will not have mercy upon her children, for they be the children of wildoms. For their mother has prayed the heart, she that conceived them has done shamefully. For she said, I'll go after my lovers, that give me my bread and my water, my wool and my flax, mine oil and my drink. Therefore, behold, I'll hedge up thy way with thorns, and make a wall, that she shall not find her purse. And she shall follow after her lovers, but she shall not overtake them. She shall seek them, but she shall not find them. Then shall she say, I'll go and return to my first husband. For then was it better with me than now. For she did not know that I gave her corn and wine and oil and multiplied her silver and gold, which they prepared for bad. Therefore will I return, and take away my corn in the time thereof, and my wine in the season thereof, and will cover my wool and my frocks given to cover her nakedness. And now will I discover her lewdness in the sight of her lovers, and none shall deliver her out of mine hand. I will also cause all her myth to cease, her feast days, her new moons, and her thoughts and all her Solomon feasts, and I will destroy her vines and her fig trees, whereof she has said, There are my words that my lovers have given me, and I will make them a forest, and the beasts of the field shall eat them, and I will visit upon her the days of Bali, when she burned incense to them, and she decked herself with her earrings and her jewels, and she went after her lovers, and forgot me, saith the Lord. Therefore, behold, I will allow her, and bring her into the wilderness, and speak comfortably unto her. And I will give her her vineyards from hence, and the valley of Ica for a door of hope. And she shall sing there, as in the days of her youth. And as in the day when she came up out of the land of Egypt, and it shall be at that day, saith the Lord, that thou shalt call me Ish, and shalt call me no more Bali. For I will take away the names of Bali out of her mouth, and it shall no more be remembered by their name. And in that day will I make a covenant for them with the beasts of the field and with the fowls of heaven, and with the creeping things of the ground, and I'll break the bow and the sword and the battle out of the earth, and I'll make them to lie down safely, and I'll betroth thee unto me for ever. Yeah, I'll betroth thee unto me in righteousness, and in judgment, and in loving kindness, and in mercies, I will even betroth thee unto me in faithfulness, and thou shalt know the Lord. And it shall come to pass in that day, I will hear, says the Lord, I will hear the heavens, and they shall hear the earth, and the earth shall hear the corn, and the wine, and the oil, and they shall hear Jezreel. And I will so unto her be in the earth, and I will have mercy upon her that had not obtained mercy. And I will say to them which were not my people, Thou art my people, and they shall say, Thou art my God.